This is why you a little boosy. Huh? Huh, Rollo? Huh? Why well, ain't fighting no case? Come with me. I I'll put you every day on this. Back with yep, some more Wack 100 content. What's going on, y'all? Oh man, Wack 100 said Rollo must be doing the work of the FBI the way he trying to antagonize Boosie. Knowing this man got a case, man, back up off him, leave him alone, bring the smoke to me. Hey, check out the items in the description box and take you right to the room and not a shop. The rumor, naughty network. Just between if he would have just that. joined the crowd that does that, boy, the problem. But because he was the host, like, he like it turned oh. out. He want to take them, and that ain't what they do, and, and create them and turn them into that. that like, like, like he's breaking the artist. Damn, that's crazy. Damn. I get that. So, Usher, Justin Bieber. Dang, man, they for Usher. Usher ain't did nothing on that <laughs> Justin Bieber. Make him a star. That's it. He ain't did a damn thing. Hey, no. That's his pain. The Jaguar right. said that no dumb. Oh, they saying like Justin, uh, like Usher brought Justin to Diddy type of shit. You know? Okay, there's no different than somebody brought game to Dre. What the fuck they supposed right. to do? He one of the hottest producers. He got all the right. plugs. What the fuck he supposed to do in business? Yeah, they keep speculating. I don't get it. Man, yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? I think but all wait, let me ask you a question, though. They keep... Like regular at trying to paint the narrative and it's making... Man, that not sure ain't did nothing. But help that kid get to where the he was going. That's, That's it. So a talent in the kid, and okay, they got writers, they got production. The money is over here. This could further. That's it. All that other. Shit. Right. So they keep they keep talking about Jay Z, right? All these social yeah, media keep they saying about Jay Z, right? What's going they on? They talking about Foxy Brown, but that's a street. You ain't gonna get nothing out of her. They already tried to talk to her. Whatever he was doing, you ain't shit. You ain't gonna get it. Right. It ain't gonna happen. Right. But they saying Jay. It's not gonna happen. They saying Jay Z and P D were like buddy buddies. Like, what that mean? I know Puffy too. What that mean? I know. That's what I'm saying. They keep putting. You know how many homies I got, bro? That's like straight masters. Yeah. Homies I got that's bank robbers. Right. Homies I got that's all kind of. Shit. Right. I'm his friend, but we rather we I'm his friend. What the doing in this personal time or whatever his thing is, is that's his thing. You telling me you got a family member that's weird as a mother right now, y'all. You the no, same? no, you can't tell you that. You you got a point there. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just cause like that's crazy. You friends with him, you may be friends with a mother brunch partner, but late night is doing with the cats in the attic. <laughs> If that got to do with you. I get what you're saying now. Yeah, they just, it's just the fact that social media keep projecting it. Why like, wouldn't Jay Z and Puffy be cool? They're both from New York. They both are in the music industry. They both then ran labels. I considered them moguls. They both didn't have to deal with each other with signing off for music. Right. Why wouldn't they? Like, what the are we talking about? What the? Why wouldn't they be? It's either you cool or you beefy. Right, 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 right. I get that point for sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. You got two execs. Two moguls. For sure. Yeah, why wouldn't they be cool? At the, at the end of the day, business is business, right? That ain't nothing. Why wouldn't they, I'm just saying, you got, like, bro, you got to remember, when Jay-Z was on his way up, he was the president of Def Jam. It's like right. this one. Listen, you got that seat? We're gonna run it up. Oh, I what you say. That's the combo. So let, let me ask you a question, right? I'm I'm gonna switch the topic a little bit on you, right, right? Uh with the Boosie and uh Yo Gotti meetup. What you think about that? The what? Uh Lil Boosie and uh Yo Gotti. What's wrong with Lil Boost and Yo Gotti? They ain't got no problem. That's what I was saying. But Rollo feels a different way, but business is business. Who the business, is right? Rollo? Right. Who was Rollo? Oh, God. Rollo is Rollo. I mean, he's just. Was Rollo around back in Lil Boosty days? He was just a. Yeah. He was a street. Yes, yes, yes. Rollo's mad because of Dolph. What the f that got to do with Boosty? Absolutely nothing. Oh, he want him to side with Dolph. Well, how about Boosie say, 
I ain't got an issue with none of them, but whatever them two got going on, that's that their ass, business. Well, we, oh, man, there you go. And how about you, Rollo, stop woofing? If you feel that way about God, he go knock him down. Right. But he got to worry about his telling. Right. Rollo telling got to be addressed. Bro. Yeah, that's a fact, man. You got to wake that up. I, I ain't going to lie. Yo, don't you gotta don't you go pull all that? Yo, we gonna run the ride over Chronicles. I'm gonna wait because that up. he keep he keep talking about different shit and it's like, yo, ain't nobody addressing the fact that this was a rat. Because he got out, bailed two dollars, gave some money away to the hood. This is this is why I don't. They did say that they, he was on the vlog with the same. I was on the phone call with him. They got him on YouTube on the same vlog with the same. That don't um, mean nothing. Get yeah, the same five thousand. He's gonna go to the party with you. <laughs> this is real. Look, you told on that right and gave us the work. Yeah, but look, I can show you. We took a picture yesterday. What the f that got to do with your? They did say I gotta make it juicy for him. You gotta run that whack. I ain't gonna lie. You gotta run that. Yeah, I mean, all these talking about. You mad at Bootsy because he took a picture with your Gotti? What the f Bootsy got to do with the f going on with some? You talking about? Nigga? Your enemies ain't his enemies. Yeah, but the backstory to that is that Yo Gotti, when Boosie was in jail, Yo Gotti did help Boosie's mom out and shit. He came to the crib, gave her some money and all that. So Boosie has like a high gratitude for them. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like Boosie can't I mean, just throw that to the side why, for why, nothing. Why? He should, shouldn't he? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He got to hold the high standard for them. Like, yo, you looked out for me when I was in jail. So what the is Rollo talking Rallo about? Rollo is trying to get that attention. At the end of the day, he want that sit down with Boosie to talk about his paperwork. I, that's what I'm getting from this. He just keep provoking Boosie. That's it. He going after Boosie. He don't give about nothing else. He going after Boosie. I don't know why. Man, Boosie ain't paying that no mind, bro. That's a fact. Rollo, leave Boosie alone, bro. You know he fighting the Fed case, man. That's really something you doing right now. He fighting the Fed case. Anything he do on social media, they know they're going to use it against you. Leading me, bro. Did the feds hire you to go trigger the man? He didn't be, bro. For real. Rollo, I, I believe now that we're going to run it. I believe Rollo, like DMX portrayed on Belly, has been contacted by the FBI to antagonize and trigger Bootsy into saying something. That may impl implicate that he may do some violence with a firearm or something. He trying to get Boosie out of his body. Because there's no reason why you tripping on Boosie taking a picture with a man that then looked out for his family when he was down on his luck. I believe the federal government has contracted Rollo or told Rollo he needs to fulfill his end of the deal. As we heard previously. And I think he's targeting Boosie, right? Right, right. To be one of the individuals that he gonna help the government take down. That's what I believe. Mm -hmm. And next week, we gonna run the paperwork. It gonna be a Clubhouse Shenanigans exclusive, part one. A Ray Gives TV exclusive, part two. And a Clubhouse TV exclusive, part three. Rollo. Oh, Rollo, you just been ingested into the hunter side of the clubhouse. You in. Is up. Content. Is up. A gun case. We filed it on him, charging with it. It's wrecking the matrix. Is crazy to this man. Yeah, yeah, you trying to, you trying to get Boosie to say some serious way, so then when he walk into court, they got some, you gonna, then you gonna just stop talking about it. Nah, Rollo, we gonna cut you off. We cutting you off right here at the crossroads. Yeah, we sending you back over there with Meet little, him at the little, crossroads. Little, we sending you over there with Lil Woody. Lock you and Lil Woody in the same <laughs> shit. And you mother, you notice him and Lil Woody ain't doing no crossing? Mm, no. What's going on with that? that that's it's like you in zone one, you in zone six, you in zone three, you in zone four. We got to figure out these. Rollo, we on you. I said, Jess, you tell them to put you on somebody else. All right, tell them put you on another caper. 
You understand what I'm saying, Rallo? Because it looked to me like you try, you co-conspiring into the takedown of Lil Boosie by the federal government. You have no reason to be upset or antagonizing Lil Boosie because of his relationship with Yo Gotti. He can't control when the trial happened. If he ran into Yo Gotti and the trial happened, what he's supposed to do? I can't talk to you, Yo Gotti, because the trial just happened. Then get the guy, but you, you trying to trigger him to going crazy and talking crazy and saying some shit. You got to insinuate some violence. We know what's going on, Rallo. We on to you. Chill out, my n Chill out. Because you done got out of jail and you flashing a whole lot, a whole lot of all kinds of shit. And we ain't seen you go to work or drop an album or do nothing to produce damn numbers. What you got? Get out of jail free card? You can run around and just do whatever you want to do and you ain't got to worry about it? Is this is why you from a little boosty? Huh? Huh, Rallo? Huh? Well, I ain't fighting no case. Come with me. I'll put you every day on this damn thing. But you leave Lil Boosie alone while he fighting that case, you hear? Stop with that man. You know he can't do nothing, say nothing, frown with nothing, retaliate on nothing. Man, are we looking at probably 60 months? Minimum. Come with that man. Talking about look at this and taking a picture with the... What's wrong with him taking a picture with the... Oh, man, y'all gonna get added down in the comments. Let me let y'all think about that. Oh, man, Wack 100 says that that boy Rollo is doing the FBI work on Boosie, man. The way he's trying to antagonize him, knowing Boosie is fighting cases. And Rollo is consistently trying to provoke him, trying to get him to say something violent or insinuate gun violence in the future as a result of this back and forth. That's what Wack 100 is saying, right? And as y'all know, Wack has been on Rollo's case for some time, ever since Rollo had a case, since he had to make it juicy for him. But, like, my bro said, I reserve the right to be wrong. And, like I said, I identify as a multimillionaire. Hey, shout out to everybody involved. Shout out to Wack 100 the whole 100 side. Most important, shout out to y'all. Y'all made this far in the video. Y'all are real MVPs. I appreciate y'all the most. But I need y'all to do me a favor. Hit that like button on the way out. You ain't doing it the way in. Subscribe to the channel if you didn't already. Share the video because it helps the algorithm. We dance. We can't do it by ourselves. And oh, don't forget to hit the subscribe to the channel. And leave for the merch copy. It's yours.